Hello everybody, welcome to the sound test room. Today I'm going to show you how to add end screens to your videos and cards to your videos. And I'm going to uh, say why that's important and why <clears throat> the particular placement, particularly the cards, is, is also useful. And why YouTube like you to do this as well. Uh, for re obviously reasons, YouTube want you to click on other content videos within their, uh, their thing. The, uh, you, no, YouTube. So anyway, first of all, we're going to presume that you have your video uploaded and ready to go. Uh, so there is your URL when it's going to be live. And at the moment, this is unlisted. And at the end, I will list it. And this will be there. And then <clears throat> we shall actually see what we've done. Okay, so you've got your tags and everything. And it's all done. You, you, you've done everything. First of all, we're going to add some end screen, uh, end screen and annotations. So these work on mobile devices now as well. So this is this is cool. So the first time, the first thing I'm going to add is uh, a subscribe button, and this will use your your sort of your logo, your your YouTube logo, and then you can move this anywhere you like. And you can see the centering cases and stuff. So if you wanted it dead center, let's see. Put it there and that would be dead center but i'm going to stick it in the door and then i'm going to add a second element and i'm going to link this to my um patreon um site and then call to action will be learn more and then i'm also going to change the image here and uh, to where's where it gone now where's it gone now patreon's oh, what is lady watson uh, Patreon's logo, though, just open that like that, and then we're going to create element, and I'm going to place that one there. Now these elements will be placed uh, not before 20 seconds before the end of the video. So this video is very short; it's only one minute 37 seconds because it's a demo for a sound pack for uh, iSymphonic, and. So it's 20 seconds before these will just pop up, but we're going to add another element because we have to have at least one video or playlist must be one end element. So YouTube want you to uh, click inside YouTube. Uh, okay, so let's do this. So we can choose most recent to upload, best for viewer, and then YouTube will decide. Or we can choose from a video or a playlist. So let's do that. Let's choose from a video or a playlist. Now you can enter a URL for uh, a, a video. So my most, let's start with H because there we, there we go, or we could paste it in. My most watched video is how to connect uh, any MIDI keyboard to an iPad. So I'm going to add that as an element, okay? So we're just going to create element and it will appear there, okay? And then you can click on that and watch it on the, when it comes up on YouTube and we'll move that there. And then I shall add another one. And I shall choose another one. I can scroll down, scroll down, and choose, say, another iSymphonic because it's relevant to this one. So we'll choose this one here, put that there. Okay, I'm going to leave that where it is. Now, this section here is very cool. So, what we're going to do is I'm going to have how to connect any MIDI keyboard come in right near the end there. And then just before that one we'll have the iSymphonic Pro and then we'll have my sort of um, Patreon thing and then we'll also move forward I think see we could move we can't move this back see what I'm saying we can't go any further back than this but we can move this forward so I'm gonna have that start later as well and then we're gonna have them drop out at different times as well just for some sort of visual effect and what we can do now is we can preview how this will actually look so we do this So we can alter the timing of that one slightly because it kind of 
messed in with that one a bit, so that's okay. So when we've done that, we have to save. So it, like when we're happy, when we're happy with that, we'll save. And now we've created, now you can only create up to four elements. Okay, so you might only want to create one or two, it doesn't really matter, as long as one of them is a video link or a playlist link. So <clears throat> let's now go on to cards here. And this will start to play. Let's just pause that. Now, this is the positioning of your video. Now, most people watch my videos, and you can get this. If you go into your main analytics page, it will say average view duration sort of thing. And mine is, average view duration is like between all the videos. But there's a lot of videos. There's over a 1,000 videos. And the average view, view duration is about three and a half minutes. Okay. Some of them will be viewed for longer, obviously, but you can't really, it's impossible to judge. But if this was, say, a five-minute video, you could say start at, say, let's see, you could say start at four and a half minutes there. But let's, this isn't, this is very short, and I wouldn't normally put cards in with a video this short. However, if we go along here, we can see as well, we could move it like this, of course, we can... Just see, but as soon as that's disappeared, the actual titles and stuff, I will place uh, 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 and, and I'll add a card. So we can add cards. Now we can add up to five cards uh, anywhere we like, and they can be a video or a playlist. We can promote somebody's channel. We can do a poll. That's cool. Uh, on, on, and we can also create a link to an approved website, i.e. so I could do the Patreon thing again uh, or what have you. So what we'll do, though, first of all, is we shall link to somebody's channel. So we're going to link to Jacob Jacob's channel, Jacob Hack's channel, who also, he also does iOS videos as well. Now all you need, <clears throat> all you need here is the name of the channel. Okay, so if you don't know the name, you could go to YouTube here, and all you need to do is just type in. Uh, wh who you think it is? I know this is. I know it's Jacob Hack, so, but if you if you weren't sure, if you if you didn't know and you knew his videos and stuff, but the, the way to easy way to find it is just type in, and there there it is there Jacob Hack, and there's Jacob's channel. And all you need, you don't need the you don't need the what's it or anything. You just need the name of the channel. That's all you need. So you know you just need to go back there now, and we'll put in J Cub. Hack there, and we'll and we'll we'll do a custom message. Um, say uh, Jacob is great. Oh, Jacob makes great videos. Now you can't go too far, okay? It will it will say, uh, and we'll just say check out Jacob's channel okay and once we've done that all we need to do is create and you, there we go we've created it there and it will be there so if we're playing along here and what you will also notice now on when you watch a video on YouTube There'll be information in, you can click on it and it'll be that's it'll bring up all the lists of what you've got. And at exactly um this time point here, which we'll we'll see. So clicking on it doesn't take you to it. It's just there is an option. If you were to click on on it now, it will take you to his channel. Of course. Now, <clears throat> he's a fine looking man, isn't he? Hey, look at that. Right, anyway. Uh, so here we go. 
and then we could go a bit further along and if we wanted to now i will probably i will leave jacobs in there and i will but we could do uh we could promote another channel or we could do the same as before we could choose a a, a video so we could just click on that there and add it and that will pop in at 58 seconds see let's edit that and let's change it to a playlist so we could choose uh, any of the playlists that we've got or anybody else's playlist it doesn't matter it, you know you, you can link to any playlist you like so let's say AUV3s for instance and that will have changed that to AUV3s and you can add up to five of these okay so tracking along here if we just click the information button now you'll see that there are two two pieces of information being added by me one for Jacob's channel one for AUV3 playlist okay and obviously when it gets to there so that's cool so that and then it'll stay on the screen for a few seconds and it'll it'll go away so net right well, we don't need that there because it's it's sorry i don't need it it's too short too short okay so let's show you another thing as well now polls are cool we can create a poll and then you have a poll question say uh so for instance which i symphonic we, you know, you do. You can relate it to the thing. I symphonic, symphonic, symphon. Which symphonic uh, pack is your dog? Is your favourite? Uh, where am I? Uh, is that even right? Yeah. <laughs> and the choices, and then you, then you could write the choices in. Like you could put uh, Harper, which is this one. Uh, Canto is another one. And we can add another choice. We could put like, uh, sorry, we could put Boto, which is another one. I don't even know if I spelt that right. Uh, well, just in case I haven't, let's choose another one, shall we? Uh, Voce. Okay, and then we can create this card here. So we've created now created a poll. And for us, so what will happen now is this. So all right, people click on that then, and then. They can they can vote for their favorite poll, and then it, it's 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 visible if they open it as well. Who, who's voted for what? So that's how you add a poll, which I shall leave there just for fun. So basically, that is how you add your end screens and cards. Now, this is let me show you. You can go to your analytics here and you can see i've got this all the scroll the bottom to end screens and cards so i've got this set on end screens and this is for this week so this week there have been five thousand and something end screen elements shown and people have clicked on 43 of those okay so you know it might not sound a lot but 43 people have linked off to another one of your videos or playlists or something and from there it's quite possible that they've linked off somewhere else and you can see also the most popular the most popular clicks basically and 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 uh what it is you see so most popular is mini v and it was clicked on via the how to connect the the thing or then someone clicked on how to connect and you can see how many times it's been clicked and how many times it's been shown and that's for this week uh, and the same thing with the um with oh, also as well you can this is a good thing as well a quick way to do this as well is you can have a look at the bar chart and it load the bar chart up for you and you can see that your mini v has been the most popular click along with the egsyl so you can you can kind of work out what's the most popular clicks which aren't 
And if you want to get really technical, you know, of course, I mean, I don't. There's too many of them. I just put them in, you know. But I tend to put recent ones in and things like that. But try to keep them kind of relevant to the to the actual video that's that, that's there. But the same thing for cards. You know, you, you can click on cards. Now, that big dip there uh, like that is just... They haven't gathered the information for the last, I got a couple of hours or whatever, or a day or so. And then, like tomorrow, they'll have fixed that, or later on today, that'll be fixed. But at the moment, there's been 14 card clicks, 30 card teaser clicks. And uh, you can see what they are there. That is for this week. So, there we go. So, that's what we have so far. And basically, we're nearly at the end now, guys. So, what we're going to do is, if we're completely happy... We can, uh, like, go back to our info and settings here. And you see that... Uh, oh, yeah, I've also added it to a, 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 a playlist. I think I've covered that, haven't I? But anyway, that's neither in or there. What we're going to do is... Uh, hit public. And... We're going to publish it now. So that's now been published to YouTube. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we're going to go to YouTube. In the next 45 seconds i'm going to show you how we took a brand new e-commerce shopify store from zero to 200 dollars per day in less than i'm going to skip that and we'll just watch it Hey, there you go. Cool beans. So, um, yeah, that is. Let me turn that down a minute. That is very, very. Who is that nutter? Um, okay, so that's it. That's it, guys. Very, very cool. Uh, so how to how to set up your cards and annotations and YouTube love it. You know, they they this is what they want you to do. That they want you to have their cards and and things. You want to click around YouTube. They, that's what they want. And what you to do you know and it's 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 how we share as a community how it works okay um many 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 thanks for watching if you do like the video give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel um and possibly if, if you if you can become a patron okie dokie and uh, oh let's see what did fred anton corvest which what did he like did he like this <laughs> who knows we'll have a look in a bit okay um fred oh Fred Anton Corvest, by the way, is the developer of FAC Chorus, which is, is is an incredible chorus. Anyway, effect for iPad. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys later.